say that there is a 911 for everyone. There is a Carrera Cabriole for someone who simply wants to pose. And if someone is always late, then there is the 911 Turbo S. But if someone wants to pose, go fast and have fun at the same time, then the Targa GTS is the perfect car. It's the one with a roof that gets eaten by a robot. Targa 4 GTS in its Carmen red color carries a more serious stance both in its appearance and performance. All the GTS models come in standard center lock wheels which are one of the most stunning and coolest things to ever grace a road car. It goes from coupe to El Fresco in 20 seconds with a touch of a button where the rear end joins the car in a true transformer style. The new sport design front apron emphasizes the sporty character. The front end is aerodynamically optimized, a low front spoiler and increased rear spoiler extension height further reduce the lift forces on the front and rear axle. The blacked out trim treatments add menace to the aesthetics, somewhat offsetting the nostalgic elegant cheeriness of the classic Targa bar, now painted black rather than silver as on the previous GTS. The cockpit is very driver-centric, everything you need is where it should be, buttons to control most of the things and the touchscreen infotainment system also does a cracking job. The cabin upgrades include the Alcantara trim on the steering wheel and also on the seats. The back seats, well, they're just for formality only, it's the front where the magic happens. The cockpit seats are firm but superbly bolstered to the point that hours of driving had me feeling as fresh as when I had first set out. Part of the lack of fatigue comes from the effortlessness of the 911 chassis. So there is 450 horsepower and 405 pounds of torque which is a phenomenal amount of power in this turbocharged uh, engine. It makes the GTS a very spicy proposition. The engine makes ever more revs, the intake noise, the mechanical clutter and the barking exhaust makes you go ever more faster. A powerful engine demands outstanding braking power as well which is fulfilled by brake discs 350 millimeter of size at the front and 330 millimeter at the back. Taking the Targa on the road has showed what Porsche has actually done to this car. The steering is sweet, powertrain superb, and the gearbox is fantastic. The seven speed PDK is sufficient, proficient, and it allows you to take charge. Put it into uh, automatic mode and it finds the right gear for every situation every single time you put it into the manual mode and the pedal shifter makes you feel like a boss the power delivery is amazing in this car there is little to no turbo lag and this thing actually flies it goes from 0 to 100 in under 4 seconds driving through corners is absolutely brilliant there is no body roll and the braking is amazing as well thanks to its adaptive dampers, um, uh, fantastic steering and also fade free braking. The noise, the lovely noise, you put your foot down and it becomes a hearty roar. The turbochargers urging you to go faster and faster. Dynamic comfortable and efficient. The Porsche is expanding its 911 range with the GTS models. The Targa GTS is a brilliant combination between pausing and performance and it is sure to raise goosebumps. 
There is a host of features available that if added to this Targa are going to cost significantly more, but at the same time, they're going to add to its beauty. Thanks for watching, subscribe and leave your comments below.